Good morning, guys. <laughs> Look at I got like a pompadour. I didn't even mean to. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> so we have. Well, you can't be seeing all this stuff, but we have our lunch here. We got a club sandwich and a fruit platter, iced tea, and CRMS. We're gonna eat our lunch. It's like noon, right? It's noon. And it's overcast out here, but um, I already feel the sun. Yeah, no, I feel it, and this is when we're really gonna get freaking burnt, burnt biscuit. Oh man, woo! Mm. I'm tired, but it, last night was so much fun. Okay, we're gonna eat our lunch now. Boop boop. Oh, that's like an eye booger in my hair. <laughs> I don't think we've vlogged yet. <laughs> we're out of the pool. We've been in the pool for <laughs> a while. For four hours. Yeah, four hours. It's an overcast dude. So it's not that hot today. Nope. It's no brown biscuitness for us. Nope. So we're gonna Yelp a restaurant and then get ready, shower, and all that good stuff. Whoop. Whoop. Hi guys, so we just finished having dinner and we just finished eating at Rooster and the Pig. It is back there and we're in a plaza right next to Rio Azul, Mexican bar. I'm not someone where I complain. I'm about to give like coordinates, cross streets and all of that because I'm not one to complain but we sat down and we got a drink, well he didn't make it in time so then we got to our table. He, even the bartender was very slow, but whatever. So we sat down, and we sat down for 45 minutes without food. 45 minutes. They kept telling us, oh, we have to go cut this and this and that. I'm um, back to, it's like, but that's not my problem. Like, I'm part of that whole customer thing. So then, so then they're chopping all the food. He said, it's going to be this and this and that. He says, oh, it's only going to be 10 to 15 more minutes for something. He goes, can I give you something else, whatever. Nothing, no. 15 minutes passed, and we're waiting, right? Right? Where we were waiting? Yep. Waiting. And waiting. And then he comes back after the 15 minutes, 10 minutes after, and says, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, I'm not going to be able to bring it out. And blah, blah. it's like, well, that was apparent. Like, that was like 30 minutes already later. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. It was like the worst experience ever I've ever had in a place. I thought it was terrible. The food was not good. It, it was so bad. Everybody else was eating except us. Everybody was getting everything quick. And right now, other people just sat down and they got their stuff so quick. So I do not know what, but it was so, to me, it was really bad. I am not a fan. And, and, and it doesn't help being starving in a restaurant. I mean, we waited 45 minutes and then it was 45 minutes where I was just like, okay, you know what? Can we just have like the radish and pickle, whatever? I saw some tables, like you can order little appetizers. She said, oh my gosh, don't worry, free of try. Well, I hope so. But then it wasn't even pickles or radish. It was a radish thing and then mangoes. I'm like, they brought us the wrong thing. I don't think she brought out the right thing because those weren't pickles. I don't know. I'm like, I'm trying to be, I, I was seriously fuming, you guys. So right now we're waiting for our shuttle to come by and pick us up. I can't wait to be picked up from this place. I'm telling you that place was, whoo, it was not the best. So we're going to continue our trip on a positive note, have some drinks. And get a hangerburg after. And we're going to get a hangerburg or we're going to get pizza after. Yeah, because that was like appetizer food. And it wasn't good at all. No, and I think it's too overly priced. Yes. It was, it was really too early because. I got a crispy beef bowl and it was it said crispy beef, egg noodle, scallion, and something else. I forgot what it was. So I got my dish and I, right away I saw them. They're like looking at it in the light and I'm like, what are they? And then she hands it to a guy and he's looking at it. Like they weren't sure what the hell it was. So then they bring it to the table. I'm like, is this the right dish? Because I saw you guys looking at it in the light. She goes, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, you know what I mean? Like nervous. It's like, I, I caught you. Like, what are you looking at it like that, you know? So then I had to ask the chef that kept going by to everybody, like, well, only to us, because he kept apologizing to us, like, five million times, explaining his issues, which, again, we're part of the customers. So, oh, well, there's, like, a little grasshopper. We should fry it up and put some chili and lime, like those little champolinas that we ate. It'll taste probably better. So then, after that, after that, what was I saying? People, like, Talking about Chapulines. <laughs> I don't know. No, I, I put it this way on a professional note that the way the whole thing was set up, not just walking into it. The, oh, the, that was even awkward. The environment was just so awkward. It's like it was. walking into a bar saloon. Like we I, I walked got, in, and right away there's a table in front of us. A table. It's like we're, we had yeah, to walk through just people, turned their heads staring at us, like, like 
What and are I, you guys doing here? Like right away, I was like, oh, hello, everybody. Did you hear me when I was like, oh my. Yeah. Yeah, this is awkward, so. Okay, we're gonna go so we can stop ranting. I just needed to get it out. So we, you know what I mean? You know we just have to say things out. So we're gonna wait for our shuttle from our hotel. Whoop. You guys, we're gonna hit the club, but we ended up at Woody's Burger. We went there last year too. So <laughs> we decided not to go out because we already drank all day at the pool. And it, <laughs> and <laughs> Yeah, and then we were still hungry after the restaurant. We were gonna go to a tiki bar again that we went to last night, but then we didn't. And then we're gonna try a new, uh, go to Villagers. What is it called? Villagers Pub? Or what is it? Village Pub. Village Pub, but then we didn't. We don't feel like turning up. Me and Glenn. We have, a, oh, babe, 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 babe. What the highlight though? <laughs> Lost. My highlight. Oh yeah, highlight. Mm -hmm. Highlight. Yeah. What am I wearing? I mix honey, gilded honey from Laura Geller. That little freaking highlight for twenty six dollars, and then ended up being thirty something with shipping. And then my new, oh my new favorite Audrey from Gerard. I mix those. I'm all into mixing, mixing my own concoctions. So now we're just waiting for our guy to come. He's really nice, the guy at the hotel. It's so funny when we got picked up from that shitty restaurant, that rooster and crap place. <laughs> it was so cute, like our guy from our hotel, because we have a free shuttle. And he goes, he goes, oh, just ask us. He goes, I'll tell you. He goes, right here is the best, right here is the, he probably named like 20 restaurants within our two minute drive back to our, our hotel. And yeah, it was every spot was good except where we went because it's like completely brand new. And he's like, oh yeah, he goes, don't don't go to brand new places. I'm like, now and now. Now we know. <laughs> we just got an elevator and all of a sudden Glenn goes like this to me and that means he's tossing me his fart. And someone Catch. entered right when we got out. <sighs> Let's just have a moment for them. Potato. Potato. That was nasty, Hot babe. Potato. I feel so bad for that guy because I always say his farts are like, they smell just like shit. No, I'm dead inside. Seriously, <laughs> I, I'm a zombie. I really am. <laughs> that guy's gonna be, <laughs> he's gonna be dead when he enters the elevator. <laughs> so I just was brushing my teeth right now with Gwen, and when we looked at the water, he was like, Why is the water so milky? And if you look at it, the hell is that? What the hell did we just put in our mouth? Babe, what is that? Vanilla water thing. The hell? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. We ain't paying that. It's recycled. All right, we gotta go. We, we gotta see if we're gonna have our teeth still or not. Whoop, whoop. Yeah, Good morning, guys. So we're checking out and we're done. We're gonna head back to LA. Are you satisfied? Yeah, this is our second time coming over here and we really like this spot. We're some of them are like, we, usually when we like the same things, we just go to the same places, huh? Yeah. Well, well, not when it's like restaurants, but this hotel is really nice. So if you guys ever want to come, it's really nice. Also, another one that's good is JW Marriott. That one's really nice. It has like a couple pools, not just one. And they have one distinctly like four kids and one for adults that will have like a DJ and then there's like another pool like a more relaxing pool I don't know but that one is good too but we're off we're gonna go have some lunch we're gonna go have Mexican yeah. Mexican <sighs> so yeah we got enough oh no is someone in that car did they leave their lights on oh I thought someone left their lights on they weren't in there so yeah we're gonna go off to have Mexican and then we're back on the road Having our Ike. Ike. It was good. 
So now we're just walking back to the car and we're gonna be on the road. It's Saturday. We came on a weekday part of the day because we were able to and um, the room was actually cheaper during the weekday, plus less crowded. So it feels a little weird that it's a Saturday right now we're leaving. <laughs> but I liked it a yeah. lot. Yeah, it was copacetic. Yeah. All right, well, we'll see you guys in the next one. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. Doo -doo. Woo -hoo.